good morning everyone. We are actually off to... Good morning everyone, welcome back to the vlogs. Vlogmas day... Eight, nine, ten, eleven. I don't know because I don't know if I'm meant to do it by the day or if we could do it by the ones I've uploaded. So Vlogmas day three. Vlogmas day one. <laughs> Good morning everyone, welcome back to the channel, hope you're all well. Me and Lewis are actually off to my parents' house this morning because we're gonna go and do the annual, annual who, what are they saying? Well, the annual who Meister. We're gonna go and get the Christmas tree. With my mum and dad. And my mum's wrote a full itinerary for the weekend. So we're busy bees. Yeah. I, I didn't really know how we part that. Requirements. There's oh. plenty of requirements. What's I that? didn't um I was just gonna speak about how we part actually. I didn't actually vlog much last night because me and Lewis basically just watched the last Deathly Hallows and then watched a bit of Fantastic Beasts and fell asleep. But um that's the plan, that's a sitch. You're just checking it out. Just checking it <laughs> out. I don't know how to see you. Because I look. Then I've seen your eyes go. <laughs> Lewis cheated on me in his dream last night. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Just the way I can work. What a bad bitch. I know. Traffic here is horrendous. It's all the parents dropping the kids off at the private school and the Teslas and that. Come on, George and Chlamydia. Uh, well, see you in Sheffield anyway. <laughs> Welcome to, it's the same vlog, it's the same vlog. I literally filmed nothing yesterday. We basically got back to Sheffield, went and got a Christmas tree. I filmed some little clips, but I didn't really speak to my camera. However, today is Sunday, we're up bright and early. We are gonna go to a little Christmas market slash garden center and have um, some breakfast. Everyone's looking at me to say what the fuck, it's 11 o'clock, but we were up early. We're just leaving later than expected. So let's go to the Christmas market and get breakfast. So we are back from the little Christmas market. It was very underwhelming. I feel like I used to go all the time as a kid. It weren't underwhelming, it was really nice actually, but I feel like I used to go as a lot as a kid and it just sent a lot bigger. And like when I went as a kid, you didn't really have to pay for anything. As in like, there's like a hedge maze and we were saying to Lou about these amazing gardens. And you have to pay for it all, so we were like realistically, like, it's not, I just said amazing gardens and like this incredible hedge. <laughs> um, but it's not actually that, Great and that excited. Nice to walk around dog everywhere, but it was really, really busy. It was nice, we had some lovely food. I didn't film any of it. I find it really difficult to vlog when I'm actually with my mum and dad. I don't really know. I don't know, I just go into like panic mode and get shy. But we're currently on the way to Meadowall. Literally just left my mum putting lights on the Christmas tree. Lewis did in fact saw the Christmas tree to the right size, so I will show you it when I get back. Mum's left putting the lights on, so when we get back, I imagine she'll be nearly done with it actually. We're not allowed to touch it, not allowed to have <laughs> any input, so there were actually no point in me currently being there. So me and Lewis are currently on the way to Meadowall. Need to get Saf a little Christmas present, and I know exactly what I want to get her. For the past few years, she's bought me a Christmas present. I've never been able to like, like afford to buy one back because and also the bitch has got everything the girl's got everything what do you buy someone that's got everything i know she doesn't like want anything either she wouldn't even accept a present off me but i've got a fun idea this year so we're going to hmb that's a little clue i will show you what i'm getting because i feel like she's going to open it today right this is what i'm planning on getting staff if anyone knows any one of these t-shirts 24 quid are you joking right success I've got Saf a little Metallica t-shirt. I really hope she gets the joke. If not, that's going to be really embarrassing and a big fat waste of money. Also, look how pretty this guy is. Look how pretty my boyfriend is. Oh, my camera's so good. I'm so glad that I'm doing vlogmas so my camera's this amazing. We're going to go home now. I don't know what the plan is for the rest of the day. We're driving back to Manchester today. But I've apparently agreed to see everyone and the kids, basically all my friends. Oh, 
all my friends at once all had babies and I've not seen any of them so I said that I would do a round of like seeing all the babies and now I'm like where the fuck am I getting this baby time from? I mean I'd bloody love to see my friends but do I have time when I've told my mom I'm going to decorate a bloody tree and everything? I'm trying to see them attack a few go under a hole. I really hope she gets the joke. I just text Anna after I bought it and I'm like, is she even going to click? Ta-da! Ta She's probably never going to wear it and it is a very silly little joke, but it's a nice little, nice little joke. Nice little drama top. She loves metallic anyway. It's a new upcoming brand. So yeah, that's the plan. Don't really know what's going to happen. Like I said, I have agreed to see everyone and their new bones. Newborn um, and one. Yeah, no, that's what I mean. They're all past newborn and all actually are fully fleshed Talking children going going up to uni next week. So... Come on, this now, you blood bunny. Right, everyone, um, whichever six. one's not being opened. Six. We are on six, yeah? We're six. Oh, the oh. Mine's already open. Oh. No, we've had six. We're on seven. Oh. We're on seven. Right, everyone. I'm back home now. I hardly filmed anything this weekend. Like I said, I don't really like filming when I'm around with my dad. I just enjoy being in the moment, do you know what I mean? But we're back home. Me and Lou are going to open our advent calendars. We Technically, open. we shouldn't be opening these until tomorrow. But Lewis is working all day, and we don't know if we're going to see each other. Guess what it is before. The, um, book. Oh, book. Oh. Oh. Butt plug number one, dos. Hi everyone, um, I desperately need a haircut. I'm just editing this vlog back and I just want to put this little disclaimer in there. Um, obviously me and Lewis got these advent calendars which are just literally full of sex toys. Thought it'd be quite fun, spice up December, do you know what I mean? But I have realised that in the next few vlogs and even in this vlog and the previous vlog, I've mentioned butt plugs a lot. <laughs> It's now a running joke in our friendship because this entire, we thought there were going to be a wide range of things in this calendar, but it literally is just butt plugs. So now I have a really weird amount of butt plugs that I'm probably never going to use. I'm not really the type, not to be too TMI, I'm not really the type of gay to use a butt plug. So I now have a bunch of butt plugs, got a butt plug for Secret Santa. So you've got all that to come in the next few vlogs. So I just wanted to say, I don't really have anything to say. I now just have an abnormal amount of butt plugs. Um, not obsessed. Not my new aesthetic. Oh, the TV just turned off. Bye. Right, Saf's presents all wrapped and under the tree. I was gonna put it down there, but then it just looks a bit shit, so I put it on there. We've got the Grinch on the TV. Not the actual normal one, the cartoon one. Making some food. Cheers, my dears. Christmas is here.